Good evening ladies and gentlemen, I'm Easy69 and welcome back to the channel. Today we are looking at the FV301, the new tier 8 light tank and what a nice little tank this is. The DPM is actually pretty good at 2707 and the penetration is actually really good for its standard AP at 226. Compare that to the other light tanks in the tier. Uh, 258 if you have the uh, using the APCR um, but I I run calibrated shells I do run calibrated shells which does drop the DPM by a couple of hundred but to be fair I didn't even know the penetration was this good so I might not even run the calibrated shells it does have 190 alpha and that gives it a 14.25 uh, rate of fire and the reload is 4.21 uh, shell velocity pretty good at 1020 and the aim time again pretty good um, not the best but pretty good at 1.72 and the dispersion is average for the light tanks it does have 10 degrees of gun depression and it goes 62 kilometers an hour so not as quick as the other light tanks but what this does have is that 10 degrees of gun depression and it actually has a really nice turret at 160 uh, millimeters the same as the lightweight which i didn't think uh was it was i didn't think it was that good but playing the tank i'm actually I'm actually bouncing people. I'm actually bouncing things. So we're going to have a look at a couple of battles here. Now, I do... Uh, I've got a new phone. The OnePlus 8 uh, Pro. I cannot play on it. It's nothing like my Razer phone. And I mean, the phone... The screen is longer, but it's a lot thinner. And I just can't get my controls right. And I, I can't play. I'm actually worried now because I can't play. I actually play better on PC than I have been on this phone. Believe it or not, I just can't get the controls where I want them. They don't fit right on the screen, and I just don't know. When I had the uh, Samsung Galaxy S8, I could turn off full screen, and that's what I need to do. I need to turn off full screen, but I just don't know how to using the OnePlus Pro 8. So if anyone knows how to turn off the full screen, um, let me know. Now, of course, because I am recording on the OnePlus you, it is going to look a bit different uh, because you, you're going to have the black edging around at the top and because it is a lot thinner. As I've said, the screen is a lot thinner. So what I'm actually thinking that I may have to do is I may have to start recording on PC. I don't really want to because it's time consuming. I won't be able to pump out as many videos as I do. Um, but currently living at my mother's, I, I have that time on my days off. I'm thinking about it. Uh, of course, because of that, you will get better quality videos. You will get better quality sound. I'm hoping the sound is better because I am recording this on my OnePlus. Uh, so I'm using my microphone. Hopefully this is the first time I've used my microphone in months, so it might not be the best. I might have it in a wrong position or not, but I'm definitely thinking about starting using the PC for footage. Um, I'm, I'm gonna have to let you know because it will be a lot easier than I mean, at the moment, this game is on my new phone. And you can see I'm bashing around everywhere. So I actually gave up and I thought, you know what? I'm going to use my Razer phone. I'm going to play with my Razer phone. And we're going to have that battle very soon. And this is the difference. This will be the difference. And you'll see the difference. Um, so that game, I mean, we are just got this uh, the VK. And you can see we can pen the bottom plate nice and easy. Not too bad. Um, I didn't think this tank would be as good as it is. It is good. Um, I don't think it's OP. I don't think it's OP. I don't think it's as OP as the tier 9, which we'll get to in the next couple of days. Hopefully tomorrow, uh, but we'll, we'll, we will see, depending on if, if I have to record on my PC or not. So that game, I mean, we got a first class, that game. Uh, this game, again, this is on on my OnePlus uh, Pro 8, and I'm, I'm trying to play as much as I can, changing the layout of the controls, but the problem is because it's so thin, the, the screen is so thin, there's only a certain place that you can put the uh, the, the, the control, the, the go forward and uh, the joystick pretty much. And it, I can't put it where I, I normally have it. And it's so frustrating, it's so frustrating. So I don't even know if I'll ever 
be able to learn to play with these controls. I really don't know. I'm hoping I do. Um, if not, I'll have to keep my Razer phone and just use my Razer phone to play and then transfer the replays to this or transfer the replays to my PC. Uh, so we will get to that. Hopefully we'll get a fix, but of course that may mean less footage. Um, but we'll see, we'll see. Less footage, but it will be much, much better quality. So I'm, I might do that because, uh, I mean, I've, I've pumped out a video every day for, what, the last two years? I mean, it won't hurt. It won't hurt to cut down. It won't hurt to cut down. But we'll see. We'll see. Um, so this game, again, I mean, look, the AP, we can't pen, we can't pen that, the E75 frontally. We'd be able to pen his hatch on top. Um, but we, uh, we, we end up getting rid of him anyway and now the enemy there's a, two tanks left now this kind of reminds me of a bulldog it does kind of remind me of a bulldog a bit or maybe uh, the t-49 without the derp gun um so again it is a it's pretty much like a tier 8 comet in a way with much better pen uh, so it is nice it is nice but for me it doesn't feel new this one doesn't feel new. So, because there are other tanks. I mean, the RU-251, very similar. They are all similar. So, we're going to watch this game now. This is my first game back on the Razer phone, where I gave up and thought, you know what, I'm going to sod it. I'm going to play the Razer phone. So, we are bottom tier, which I like. I like being bottom tier because it does show just how good it can be against those uh, those tier 9 tanks now i did get lucky because the enemy i mean the enemy uh, tier 9 tanks wasn't the best of players in fact the two tier 9 tanks um were probably the worst players on on the team by a long shot so you can see there we are bouncing a shot from that german bulldog and that's because we are hold down that's because we are hold down we're using a bit of gun depression and we have got that turret um a little bit stronger um but you don't rely on don't rely on the bounces i mean it's 160 millimeters and just because i'm saying you use that gun depression it doesn't mean that you're going to bounce everything i mean i've come up against these hold down and i have shot the turret nice and easy um easy pen so don't rely on the bounces don't rely on the bounces but i'm not saying it's not possible you can get bounces on the turret that's about it you can't get bounces pretty much anywhere else but it is a light tank so you shouldn't really expect to get bounces uh anyway so this game so far we're on 800 damage this pattern just has no freaking idea what he's doing so i'm going to try and farm him but that is before this tiger 2 comes and of course i want to want to go for him he is aiming for our tanks he's full hit points and he has got a lot of armor so whilst he's not looking at me i am going for him and trying to just bring him down very quickly and as some of you know i love these little pew pew guns i love these guns um so much i love these little tanks they are fun to play especially if tanks don't look at you um so that is what we do in this game no one wants to look at us the only person that wanted to look at us was that german bulldog and he's now gone so there goes that guy we're going to take out the uh, pattern i don't think we're actually going to kill him no i think we are actually and now we are there's a couple of tanks here. It is a four versus three, so we should have this. I've got plenty of hit points, but this SU actually makes a very bad decision in rushing me, and now I'm going to use the mobility of this tank. It's a light tank. The traverse is pretty good. The speed's pretty good, and he is in a bad... Now, now he's in a bad, bad position, and luckily for me, no one is actually around me, so all this damage is mine baby it's all mine um so we're just farming him and there's nothing he can do there goes the tiger too it just leaves this guy and a lever nice little uh hit markers there that's the, actually the first time i've noticed the hit markers since playing i don't notice them at first i thought it'd be a great idea but to be honest you, you don't in in battle you don't notice them. You don't. I only notice them because I'm when I'm recording this replay, and I've literally just noticed it then. Um, other than that, you don't really notice it. So that is the F3 FV301. Pretty nice tank, but again, nothing too special. I don't think it's OP. It is a fun tank to play, but there are, I think, there are better light tanks in Tier 8 than than this. The RU251, I probably prefer over this. Um, so we do get the ace. We do get the ace. Uh, not many credits earned, but that is the FV301 hope you enjoyed the video guys hope the sounds okay there will be better content coming soon i'm meedy and i'll catch you soon